Good afternoon. I am Kenneth Price of the No Bull Channel. And today I want to talk about YouTube view counts because according to the view counts at this channel, the No Bull Channel has been the worst YouTube channel of all time. So let's take a look at it and try to figure out what's going on. Okay, so here we are at the No Bull Channel. On August 18th, 2019, and the header looks okay, the uh, icon looks okay. I mean, it looks good enough to get um, a couple thousand views. So let's take a look at starting from the bottom. I was first starting out, or well, I didn't even have a thumbnail, I was just picking whatever I could, uh, whatever looked good. I was getting about 10 views. Here I got 19 views. Now keep in mind that what's in the title here, Blue Sky Report, and then there's also Aircraft Chemical Discharge. These are words that should sort out, I would think, quite uh, easily if anybody looking at a, a sky report or a weather report or a coast report. Um, you know, contrail or chem chemtrail report. <clears throat> I know there's a lot of people out there looking for this kind of thing, and it um, would seem to me that with about half the population, let's say we got about 3 billion people that are hooked up to this Internet, either with a cell phone or a computer, I, I, I ought to be getting more views than, than 19 or 6, or here I got up to a whole 61, and then over here up to 38. Now, when I went to putting a logo there with the, the no bull cow, that didn't help the views. And then I went to putting a really nice looking background with a, a more professional looking logo. And I started doing things on tide pools, um, disgusting pollution, no chemtrails. And look at the views, just stayed 9, 13, 16. All right, so I kept going. I tried, let's take a look at this one up here. 7,000 brand new cars parked at failed nuclear plant. 34 views. That seems just impossible. Here's one, Long Beach Peninsula. Well, how many people are coming to the peninsula and they're looking up things on the Long Beach Peninsula all the time? Six views. And it just goes on and on. The latest video I put up on the 17th yesterday has gotten four views. The one I put up the day before that got one view. One view, really? Like I said, this must be the worst channel that has ever <laughs> appeared on YouTube. Or is there something else going on? Because it just seems to me that unless they're hiding this from from appearing that, that people would see this well let me tell you something else about my channel and that is the fact that i have another channel and that's this channel right here kenneth m price jr and at this channel uh <clears throat> i got into it pretty deep with the titanic uh, let's go down to the bottom here Titanic is in five, let's go over here. Titanic is in five pieces, part one, the motive. 245 views. Are you kidding me? Titanic is in five pieces. That seems like that would be a pretty, uh, uh, you know, explosive thing to, to sort. Part two, I got 310 views. Part three. 280 views. This is just is just unbelievable. So I have known from the start that YouTube has been hiding my views because this was my first channel, and the fact is I blew the cover off. I blew the, I blew the story on the Titanic that it was in fact professionally demolished, just like a 911 scenario, and. 
you can watch these videos down here at the bottom these podcasts i'm sorry these were made by professional people um, one is with the higher side chats and if you go to the higher side chat website you'll find that this video has received over 10,000 views and then i was also on veritas radio and that got over 10,000 views but when you come here where i posted the link here hardly anything 155 and 343 by the way i have not had one person challenge me on what i report with regard to the titanic being on the bottom in so many pieces now i've also done some pod uh, interviews i'm sorry videos on the uh, the oil auto industry and the collusion involved there and for instance here's a video on we never needed petroleum and that got 134 views you know if when i look at the view counts here they're all kind of in the same range aren't they we go from like 37 up to 343 okay there's one that's over a thousand that's a musical that's a four minute very short mute set the music and yet only just over a thousand views so to me these the view counts here are all very close to being about the same and that's where i think i've got some pretty good proof that they're messing with the view counts so when i started this new channel i was curious if i would get any view counts and i didn't and the other day i put on here as a title i put on here titanic and hindenburg both blown up and i got one view so <laughs> this is a hard one um well I, I i guess i should say this is not a hard one to figure out YouTube is obviously messing with the view counts because how could these all be so low? I mean, one of these would have would have garnered some attention with the different titles and thumbnails and pictures. I mean, but they're all down there in the cellar. That's why I have no doubt that my numbers are being deliberately kept low because I know that within the first 24 hours, if a video doesn't have any views, it's history. So, folks, I'm really curious what you think about this. I am curious myself how, how I could have created the lowest view count YouTube channel out there on the Internet. Maybe, it, maybe that did happen, but I think something else is going on and I might add that in all of the um, videos that I've done in the podcasts regarding the Titanic and the Hindenburg having both been deliberately you know uh, demolished I have not had one person challenge me not one person so I think their only defense is to just keep me quiet so that nobody knows me. And I haven't really made an issue out of that because my channel is still here. I haven't been disappeared. I feel pretty lucky about that. But if you are a little bit interested in the story of the Titanic and the Hindenburg, be sure and check out my website at kennethmpricejr.com. And I have the book at the other website which is right off that website titanic and .com. the whole book there is absolutely free and i published it that way for a reason it has 245 charts and illustrations and photographs that i could not publish otherwise without doing it non-profit so it's non-profit fair use you can look at all the drawings you can judge for yourself what really happened to the Titanic and the Hindenburg. So I hope this isn't too much off the subject. I hope it clears up maybe some questions you might have all had about how I created the worst channel on YouTube of all time.
Thank you very much for listening.